Good morning. Today I am doing a vlog just for today instead of my normal like weekly vlogs. Even though I haven't really been keeping up with them. But I am decided to do this today because one, it is snowing. And so because of that, I am off today. And Corey is doubling, so I'm home alone all day long, and I didn't want to be like a sad girl and just watch videos, because that's what I tend to do. <laughs> so instead, I made some tea, good old, good old good green tea, and I'm going to do some meditation headspace, which I'm excited about because I've moved on from the basics to like, like how this one is titled Blurry Kindness and it's all about like self-love which is great and something that I am trying to practice so yep and then I'm thinking I'm thinking today it's really dark there we go I had my tea I ate like a fruit bar thing so that I'm not all hungry while I'm meditating and then I'm probably gonna watch some TV with some Netflix maybe friends and then it's just so gorgeous look at it look look at this this is what I'm staring at here all the build up on the tree look at that nature. Exciting. But yeah, I'm, I'm just planning on doing a whole bunch of different things to make myself feel better. So, like I don't feel awful, but you gotta take care of yourself. Well, that was refreshing. I just finished my 20 minute meditation practice and it was like, it was weird because usually I'm used to doing the shorter ones and so he like talks a lot more but in the longer meditation he just like <clears throat> like he'll talk and then he'll go silent for like a period of time and you're supposed to be thinking about what he's talking about but my mind is all and so I, I kept forgetting what I was supposed to be thinking about but it was still nice because I used like um the tea bags for my tea my green tea I put this on here because I feel like that's probably good for me and then towards the end of the practice I started like just rubbing them all over my face <laughs> but uh, yeah the grazing what are you doing is it cute <laughs> um, so I put together a list a few days ago a few days ago I put together this list for like self-care and self-love because I need I need me some of that I've been I've been kind of struggling in that department for a few months but once I realized that my issue was that I didn't love myself once I figured that out that's why I was so sad I have been able to pick myself up more and understand it was just like the whole part of it was just understanding that I didn't like myself I didn't love myself anymore and then once I figured that out everything starts coming together all of a sudden I'm able to do things for myself again you know like it's just great I'll link, I'll link a video in the description that I watched that made me realize that I didn't love myself and how to fix that because she is amazing the the girl that I watched your video it's, it's so good but anyways here's my list doing what I want doing what's best for me spending time with myself accomplishing my goals getting things I want done done because for a long time 
I would just, I would set goals for myself and I'd be like, yeah, I'm going to do it. And then I would do that practice like one time and then I'd be, the next day, I just wouldn't pick it back up again. Like I have a vision board over there. And I put that together and I'm like, this year I am going to do all these great things. I'm going to make my hair that color. I'm going to do photo shoots like that and that. And I'm going to do a bunch of yoga. I'm going to see the ocean again. Like, I want to eat good, make art like that, do more yoga, cool stuff, right? Get fit, all this awesome stuff. And then, I just never started doing it. So, uh, the past few days, maybe like, it's almost been a week, alright? Um... I've started to take steps to actually accomplish my goals and make sure I do things and that way at the end of this I'll be happy because I'll have finally accomplished something that I want to accomplish and I'll be more productive and I'll feel just all over better. So um, and then I wrote enjoy myself. I matter most to me. And then I wrote like categories like things that like artistic, creative, exterior body, interior body, mindfulness, soul. And that's those are the categories that I want that like all this comes from. Like <laughs> these are the most important things to me. And so, all these things help me accomplish those main categories. So I'm going to do as many of those main categories, things, all the things that stem from the main categories, as much as I can today. The first one on the list is meditate, and I already did that. And then, yoga. See, my thing with this is, <laughs> see, my thing with... Um, why I paused about yoga is because underneath yoga I have do workout but yoga in itself is a workout and I didn't truly understand this when I wrote it and it wasn't until like the day before yesterday that I actually understood that yoga actually is a real workout because I did like it was a self-love one so I'm all yes <laughs> and it was like it was a 40, no, it was a 50 minute workout. And when you're doing yoga, since it's such a slow paced thing, you don't realize that you're actually working out. And then it wasn't until like the next day I, I, I like slept and slept. And then when I finally woke up at like noon, I was like, <laughs> I didn't realize that 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 yoga workout took it so took so much out of me but it's all good so I guess I'll do a short yoga practice then like a wake up one maybe probably like 10 minutes and then I'm not gonna work out like the, the big workout just yet cuz I need to consume some protein first cuz I haven't had like anything like I had tea and I had like a fruit strip thing. Kind of like a fruit roll up, but it's real fruit, you know. So. Not much protein in that, if any. So. I'm gonna do my yoga. Make some protein. Maybe make some protein first, and then watch friends while I'm making that, and then do yoga. I don't know, but stay tuned. So. In this bath, looks it looks kind of dirty, but I swear it's not. It's because I put green tea in here, and oatmeal, and outside vinegar, and an oil, sunflower, and avocado oil. Let me find my my sock. Here's my sock. <laughs> so this sock, you can see all that. That is coming from the oatmeal. I put oats in here and three green tea bags right here and I just tied it off 
and what this does is it moisturizes your skin and it detoxifies your skin. It helps any redness, inflammation. It's good for all kinds of stuff, taking baths and oatmeal. But this is my first time doing it because everything that I learned on the internet says to put your oats directly into your bath, like freely. And I feel like that would just clog my drain. And so I finally saw this other video and this lady in like probably her 40s or 50s use a sock and I'm like wow older women are so smart <laughs> like jeez this is just it's great because it won't clog and I can just throw all that stuff in the trash when I'm done and then wash the sock and do it again it's perfect so yeah this is the oatmeal bath I forgot to mention that I did eat my breakfast, which is Greek yogurt, cheese seeds for protein, and then I did yoga, I did my workout, I watched an episode of Friends, and yep, yeah, and I'm in the bath, and um, I was going to tell you about Michigan, because we're moving there really soon, but I'm going to wait until I'm... So I just got out of the bath. Uh, my skin feels very, very soft right now, which is awesome. I didn't use lotion or anything, it was just the ingredients that I put in my bath. And it worked really well. And it felt really nice. I like squished the sock like over my head <laughs> to make sure it all got in my hair because, like, it's not just good for the skin, you know? It's good for the hair, oatmeal, and apple cider vinegar, and all that stuff that I put in there. Um, and I only, I only put like a little bit of oil and a little bit of vinegar. Most of the stuff that was in the bath was the actual oatmeal. And then I used like three tea bags. They're green tea. But, yeah. Hi Grayson. Baby bitch. <laughs>